I want to start off this video by saying I am pissed. I am pissed at myself. <laughs> Hello, beautiful people. So, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you other than I hate myself. <laughs> but then again, what's new? It has honestly been the most hectic past couple of weeks. Like, oh, oh. It's just hectic. It's just hectic. Whether it's work or apartment things or friend things I have to keep up with. Obviously, I have to keep up with my pals. Like, believe it or not, I actually have a social life outside of YouTube. Not only that, but there's been like so many good things coming out lately. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but like, Thing after thing after thing has been coming out and I'm like, I can't keep up. I can't keep up. I am only human. I'm only human. And I Generation, I feel like I've just put it in the back of my head and I don't want it in the back of my head because it's one of my favorite things, but it's just like, and I've been preventing myself. That's the other thing too. It's like I'm preventing myself from watching it so that I can film my reaction to it. What have we learned today? I am full of excuses. <laughs> I have nothing but excuses. You want excuses? I'll give them to you on a platter. Finale time. Let's, let's hope, okay? Let's hope that the hype keeps up, that it gets a season two. Thank you. If, if any of y'all can advocate for season two, please do. I literally commented on Justice Smith's post. Like, yes, like I want season two. <laughs> Like the fangirl I am. What is that? What's that? Is that Furby? Oh wow, beautiful. Goodness gracious. Okay, you know what? I can't when it comes to these AirPods. Why? I don't know why. If anybody has any tips why my AirPods keep like tuning out, let me know. Today has been like the past like two weeks it's been like this and I don't know why. Cause when I connect it to anything else it's like fine. But for some reason my laptop it just like spazzes out. That means it's concerned. I make a similar sound when I have to take a shit, so I relate to Furby in that way. Holy! Jesus! Oh my god. Is she still like going through it? Because I want to see her happy so bad. Like, ugh. But sex. What time? Time and place. That's what I need for that. Just kidding. Stay away from my asshole, please. Been up all night? Yup. Yup. Been there done that. I love how there's always text like above it. Like it feels so real and authentic in that way. Hour nine? Hour nine of what? Serenity. Peaceful. <gasps> wow, what is that? Oh my god, I want it. Riley could be a mermaid. If Riley jumped into the ocean and grew a tail, I wouldn't be surprised. You can have it if you want. Can I have it? I want. My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why. I'm out of bed morning rain clouds out my window And I can't sleep at all Oh my god, what are you doing with this old man, Riley? I just went to the beach For real? <laughs> my love is breaking out Oh, are the hours cause like her sleep? Yeah, it's probably her sleep How many hours she has gone without sleep? Me and Anna waited for you this morning Ah. Oh. I'm sorry, I should have told you I was grabbing stuff from my house. This episode's yeah. such a mood. Sam! Sam! Also, can I just say, I have known this man for years, and I had no idea up until about a week or so ago. If y'all have ever seen the show Misfits, it's like a British show, I watched it when I was a kid. I watched it when I was a teenager, and one of the main characters, his name is Curtis. This is him! This is literally- this man is British. I love him. I love him. I love him. That's all I have to say about that. But when I called Greta's mom, she referred me to Greta's aunt, and she told me that it wasn't just a couple sleepovers. You don't know how she, she ratted me out to Sam? Okay, I don't know why you're coming for me right now. I haven't talked to her since- Yeah, why are you coming for Greta? Oh my god, they're concerned about you. They're trying to help you. Stop it, Riley. My aunt gets you a job, and she takes you in out of the kindness of her heart. And yep. you get mad because she won't lie for you? Yeah. <laughs> the best part about tonight is that you get to stay in my room because my mom is secretly hoping we'll hook up. <laughs> oh, about you staying here. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he broke up with me, but it was never real in the first place, so I can't really be upset. Um, so. I still feel so sad for Nathan. Like, I can't help it. 
I want Nathan to be happy, but Chester obviously doesn't want him, so it's just. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yes. Oh, that's the best. There is a tsunami coming and you need to pack right now. Yes. Oh. <laughs> you need to hurry a little bit. You need to hurry. Hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry Naomi. It's a tsunami, damn it. I'll never ever be friends with Billie Eilish. Girl, same. I'm never going to be friends with Billie Eilish. You know who would love this? Delilah's baby. We should go to the fire station and leave this for Delilah's baby. Oh. Delilah's Panda Express girl? N uh, no. Oh. Or, did I just have one? <laughs> she is rolling off her ass. Wait, I, I think I just saw it. It said 20 hours. She's literally been like almost a whole day with no sleep. I used to have sex. So loudly and it was so loud. <laughs> Yeah, I remember that sex, unfortunately. I remember that episode. Megan is loud when she has sex. She sounds like a freaking warthog. Yeah, come on. Come on. <gasps> Who are you not going uh, with? Let's never get her high again. <laughs> let's never get her rolling again. Oh my god, Riley! Are you gonna tell me Megan's gonna calm her down? Megan has some Let wise words of wisdom. You know what it is? Black and yellow, black and yellow. <gasps> Hour 23. Goodness gracious. Finally! <laughs> Finally! Hi. Where have you Hi. been? <laughs> Chester literally makes things so much better. As soon as you see Chester's face, it's like everything's better. I really hope that she gets her happiness because, goodness gracious, it's been too long for Riley. Like, I don't like seeing her this way. I don't. Like, I want her happy. Fight this feeling anymore. Oh my god, I know this one. <gasps> Valentine's! Oh! And everything's out in the open. And all the fake dating Nathan tension is over. My heart ships Nathan and Chester. I'm sorry, it does. But at the same time, these two are cute as f so like, what am I supposed to do? I've forgotten what I started fighting for. Ever. <laughs> Pre-order my EP August 22nd. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got hot and heavy. Oh, are we getting hot and heavy? Never mind. I'm so into Oh. I can't help it. Like they're so cute too. Surprise. Surprise, uh, Chester. We are in love and we don't want to see other people. That's a mood. When tries to come here. Uh, you always say you love an indoor outdoor illusion. Oh my god, where are they? I want I wanna be yes. here. Can I join y'all? <laughs> All third wheel, it's okay. I did not think I'd love smashing stuff as much as I did. Really? <laughs> I thought you liked to so smash so Chester. Do you have any weird sexual Ooh. Ooh, okay. Go crazy. I always wanted to get a blowjob in the shower. That's it. Oh my god, oh, same. Boy? I literally say I was like, okay. How you up? Oh. Oh. <laughs> um, yes. I think you would love it, and that would honestly actually make it fun for me. Oh. Oh my god. Why are they so freaking cute? Like, can you like get out of my face? <laughs> we have no connection except as friends. Zero romantic connection. Exactly. I'm, I'm basically throwing up thinking about us being right. anything but friends. Same. I'm gagging. Like they threw away an entire sisterhood because a wavy haired man child existed. Is she so on this? I don't think she knows the whole thing was made up. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm sure he just said like we broke up. You know. Oh, okay. It's great. Okay. What's going on? What is going on? Come on. What? Let's just take this picture now. What is okay? happening? Hi. Hey. Um. What's happening? Literally. Uh, okay. Lamar is in. Are the they? Air. They were good. Like not too long ago. Oh, Mark. Waters. I mean, I'd rather Mark than Megan. So. <laughs> That's fine, I guess. If by instinct you mean the design sense of a teenager, then I couldn't agree more. You know how you people sure say opposites attract? Myself? Yeah. I feel like Megan and Mark are too opposite. <laughs> you never show your whole self to your family, and, and I mean, I know that's what it is to be a teenager, but... Oh, Mark's trying to understand. I want to know the other parts of you, too. 
I like Mark. I like Mark. Oh my god. Megan, why can't you be like Mark? I feel like Mark deserves way better than Megan. Can I just say that? I think he deserves better. Oh, sweet dad. Fine. <gasps> I'm fine. Oh. Oh, we get the conversation. What did she say? Of course my talents come out. But Chester just broke Nathan's heart. Is that all she said? And that's what made Bo so like... Like that? Yeah, yeah, get in there. That's so weird. Please tell me what. Take it down. No. Makes the kids happy. I want the kids. Why is she freaking out over a, a backdrop? Is when you literally down, get okay? peeved over a freaking backdrop. Riley. Uh, can she just like get with Greta already? <laughs> can that just happen already? I'm like, I've been ready for them. I've been ready for them since day one. And we're almost to the finale now. So if they don't get together, I'm going to. Lose it. It's okay that I said what I said to Cooper, right? I mean, no. Obviously, <laughs> shouldn't let myself feel guilty about it. Riley, hi. I mean, you should still feel guilty. Look, girl, my parents. Uh, girl, oh, shit. At Shut up. Shut so, up. Not what showing up is. That's. That's. God. Uh, she is going through it. Uh, <sighs> I hooked up with Luz. Oh. So. Oh. So yeah, uh, oh. Oh. I like thought that you liked me, so just like what's what's wrong? With nothing. <gasps> There's nothing wrong with Please you. Please talk. I, I I wanted to tell you. Hi. That. Having fun? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you kidding me? I don't want to tell your parents about a little. Every time. Every time. <laughs> the kids are hot dead. <laughs> Something's not right. Yeah, you in the head, I Megan. Know. How long has Chester been dating that boy? Uh. Um. Riley? Riley? Just say like two weeks or something. What the hell? Nathan made it all up. No, uh. No. Can you just. Riley? Can you not? Can you not say anything? Can you, can you oh say my God, girl, you are the worst liar on earth. There's something I kind of know that I kind of need to tell you. Three. Uh, I'm kind of happy at the same time that I waited this long <laughs> because now I don't have to wait, right? Because that was a cliffhanger. It's like there's so much going on. Like I have to know now. Yeah. Fuck this. Literally, my middle school dances were more lit than that. Ooh, Cupid sucks dick. I hope so. What do I feel like? Uh, I feel like Bo's gonna break his heart. Uh, uh. What? What? <laughs> Why are me and Chester so in sync? Is this because of the fake dating thing? No. Um, because I really, I feel like not. you overreacted to all of them. Oh my god. He's breaking up with him. You were the, the smartest, funniest. That's just, don't do that. Uh, That's yeah, like, literally. No. Cut that shit. Cut that. He literally just pulled a it's not you, it's me. Boy, bye. You literally had the greatest thing ever in your hands and you just let it slip away. I just wanted to say that like, I was the one who started the lie. Like he, he was just doing- Look at Nathan. Yeah, no, I, I, Nathan literally loves Chester and he's still going out of his way to try and make this happen. I'm just his yappy chihuahua. Yeah, I, I don't think so. Oh, wow. Um, I, I want to be in a two person thing. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Man, they never make throuples work out, do they? They never do. Great, just what we needed. I already feel like this episode is like so hectic and we're not even halfway oh through. Fucking told Cooper! Told him what? Uh. I was on wisdom teeth drugs with multiple Percocet! And when the she drugs was! Were, so you know, and I Ugh. just didn't want anyone to fucking know! So I could just didn't mean, mean it! Why would you do that? Because she was high! She didn't mean it! I do think Naomi should have said something like afterwards. At the same time, it's like it was a complete accident. Like she was literally on Percocet. Like, I don't know, like, I, I would cut slack. I would. Both of you keep saying you're not something, and it definitely feels like something energy, and... Because they are. They're gonna get married one day. I like you. Hey, I, I want to be with you. 
What? It's hard for us to understand how you could break up with someone that you were never dating. Oh! Uh, who told you? Uh, I also don't want him to be mad at Riley though. <laughs> like, all of these were accidents. Like, accidents happen, guys. <laughs> guys. You told my mother? No. Uh, I, she, she figured it out and then I didn't cover her fast enough. Okay, so why didn't you tell me after? Okay. Oh, God. Wait, you this is a mess. This is a mess. The 16 year friend who dumped me to go to winter formal with a guy? I, you said it was okay. I obviously didn't mean it. Did I know how much it stuck that you were sticking your fingers in my brother's mouth? And going on about how his hair made you want to go? Oh, it's happening. Um, oh my god, no. my ship. My ship. He's getting naked. Ah! Ooh. Ooh. Are you telling me to own my story? Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want, though. Now I know how I feel. <laughs> I, I love that. Ooh. Oh my god, it's happening! Oh my god, it's happening! It's happening! <gasps> oh, it's not happening. <laughs> uh, go, go right now! Literally. What were they even drawing? I've seen kindergartners finger paint better than that. Can I say something first? Because. If I don't say it right now, I might- Oh my god, they're finally gonna so, talk. They're finally gonna talk. When it comes to kissing or making out or whatever, I don't want that. Oh, oh my god, is she, um... Oh. So I don't know Asexual? Oh my god, that's fantastic. Um, <gasps> wow! I never stopped liking you. Um, I actually, um... I love you. <laughs> I love, I love you. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! At night at the motel. Um, I, I left. After oh man, she still doesn't know. Put the music back on. <laughs> okay, Drake. Honestly, they don't deserve this. I, they don't deserve it. They don't. I feel like this place is like Winchester's in a mood. I'm not in a good mood, so I'm kind of worried about that. Are you okay? Sorry, it's Who is this? Who did you call? Where, where are you? I'm, I'm just... That's Sam? Um, I'm sorry, Sam. Oh, it is Sam. Oh, I feel so bad. Chester keeps getting his heart broken. It's you. Who? Who? I wanna be is that how it ends? Is that how it ends? First and foremost, First and foremost, we need a season two. We need that immediately. Just my thoughts, just my thoughts. Um, first of all, Chester Nathan, I ship it. <laughs> I just love a build and I feel like they've been building them for a while now, like for the whole season we got a build on them. So I really like that. <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm a sucker for the whole friends to lovers thing. I mean, that's literally me and my boyfriend. <laughs> I do feel like they have chemistry. I do. I want both of them to be happy. And if they can both make each other happy, that would be like fantastic. Greta and Riley, finally. Finally? Finally. I am so happy that she's asexual because, okay, I don't know about you because I obviously haven't seen every movie or every show, but for me, I've never seen an asexual person depicted on screen before. The fact that we are able to have that represented in this show is fantastic. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. really hope this whole loose thing doesn't get dragged out any further though, because I feel like it is. I feel like, again, this might come into play for the future, and I really hope it doesn't, because I feel like we finally are getting our happily ever after with Greta and Riley, so I'm like, can we please just like let them be in love now? <laughs> now with the whole Cooper, Delilah, Naomi, and then Ariana mess, I feel like that's where like, 
probably a lot of people are gonna have different opinions on that, which again, like I totally see why. But I feel like Ariana's just being too unfair. Naomi did have that perfect example that like Ariana literally dated her brother and like made out with him in front of her multiple times and she was still her friend. She didn't like it, but she was just like still accepting of it and didn't like hate her afterwards, right? Like she she literally tried to help her get through it too when Nathan and her broke up. So like, so Ariana not supporting her friends being with a guy and being very salty about it is just so unfair to me. Like they supported you when you were with your relationship or whatever, so why can't you support them when they have a relationship, you know? I understand from her perspective, like to be upset and like kind of like saddened obviously that it's like, oh, like I'm the single one of my friends and obviously like a girl gang, like, we're not gonna have as many girl nights anymore because they're gonna be busy with like Cooper or whatever. So like I get like her disappointment, but I wouldn't be like as angry because I feel like she she's very resentful and angry towards them for this. And it's just like, like I personally, I don't know. At the end of the day, yeah, like support your friends. Like you have to support your friends and their happiness. If they're happy, it's like, how can you not be happy for them? I don't know, I don't know. Cooper and Delilah. Yeah, <laughs> I would have liked more development between them in order to really ship them. I don't hate them, but I just, uh, yeah, I don't really care for them. <laughs> Those are all my thoughts. Let me know all your beautiful thoughts in the comments below. Thank you all so, so much for watching. Until next time, you beautiful freaks. Mwah.